Well, in commiserations, not the result we wanted and probably not the one we expected at half-time. Is What's the sort of mood like in the dressing room after that one? Yeah, obviously very disappointed. Um, I think if we start from the positives, which is the first half, um, almost a perfect away performance. You know, we was resolute in defence, uh, we attacked well, and everything we worked on, um, we put into play. But it's a 90-minute game, uh, or 95-minute game, um, and the second half was disappointing. There was a few lapses of concentration, um, bits that we could have avoided definitely we worked on in training, so that's frustrating, but again, you know, this is a long season. Um, we need to iron out them bits fast, uh, go back to our structure, go back to keeping clean sheets, being hard to beat, um, but there's plenty to work on. I'm sure there's a bit of deje dejection after a defeat, especially when the team comes from behind. Is there, is there a bit of resolution there too in the dressing room? People really willing to see what the problems are, iron them out and stuff like that? Absolutely. Um, look, it's really important that we don't get too frustrated. Um, today will hurt. You know, we've conceded four goals. Um, we've, we've conceded too many goals in the last four games. Um, we came with a clear game plan. It worked first half and unfortunately we went away from it in the second half and we've been punished. But like I said, we need to bounce back very quickly. Um, we can't be uh, too down for too long because games come very fast. Um, it's, just, it's just about putting this right as fast as possible. A lot of the talk, of course, is about how we started the season, the last few games. The manager was very clear that all that's gone, you know, win, wins and losses, they're all gone. And it's about now, now onwards, really, isn't it? Absolutely, yeah. It's as simple as that. Um, you know, when we was winning games, I've said it before, I'm probably bored of saying it, but we can't get too high. When we lose games, we can't get too low. So we've got to come back in tomorrow, straight away, um, iron out the flaws, uh, iron out what's not gone right today, and then come again stronger on Wednesday. And the way that you know yourself talking to the guys at the radio and stuff seems like you're very clear about where those uh, you know opportunities to improve are as well. You know, it's uh, some clear things to address. Absolutely. Listen, deep down, I'm as frustrated as anybody. Um, I'm gutted about today, but at the same time, um, I've got to be one of the mature ones. I've got to be one of the senior pros that you know tries to stay level-headed throughout this. It's clearly disappointing. Um, it's just about fixing it. Um, the manager is very, very good at that. Um, we've got to stay positive, but we've also got to stay real as well. Um, we'll work extremely hard and, like I say, help everybody through this and, and let's let's come out the other side on Wednesday night. And then, yeah, again, move on quickly to Wednesday, don't we? Let's go over to Millwall. So, uh, yeah, there'll be a, an opportunity to get things right in the next few days, see if we can put it into action in, in that game. Absolutely. There's loads of games coming up. Uh, full focus goes on to Wednesday. It's going to be a very tough game. Um, it always is there. And yeah, like I say, let's get things right, get three points and then uh, keep look looking forward.